For business with multiple outlet, it is sometimes necessary to transfer stocks. By keying in and recording your transfer in the backend system, our POS system is able to automatically adjust the stocks on hand for both outlets. For example, I would like to transfer a quantity of 50 Skittles from my store to the warehouse. Here's how we would do it. Before we begin, take note that the initial inventory on hand in the store is 100. while the quantity on hand at the warehouse is 50. Let's begin. To carry out a stock transfer, hit the inventory button on the left hand side of the screen. Select the location you'll be transferring the stocks from, which in this case is the Red Hue store. Click the transfer tab at the top and click on the transfer stock button at the top right hand side of the page. This will bring you to the new stock transfer page. First, select the location you wish to transfer to. In this case, let's transfer the stocks to the warehouse. Next, click on add product to select the product you wish to transfer. If you have a large number of products you wish to transfer, select the import from file options. For this example, we'll proceed with the add product option. Search for the product you wish to transfer and once you find it, select them and click Add Stock to confirm. Key in the quantity you want to transfer and select Create Transfer. This will bring you to the transfer page where you can update the transfer as it happens. Since you will be the one sending the goods, Click on Send Goods and confirm the quantity before sending. Remember to key in the reference number at the top which helps the receiving outlet find the transfer order easily. For the transfer order to be completed, the receiving outlet will have to confirm the transfer. Head to the transfer menu and select your reference number. Select the Receive Goods option and confirm the receivement of stock once it arrives. Remember to key in the reference number at the top. Once done, only the sender can confirm the completion of the transfer. Let's head back to the transfer overview from the Red Hill store and click complete transfer to finish the process. So let's check on the stock count now. And you will notice that the stock on hand at the store have decreased by 50. while the stock on hand at the warehouse have increased by 50.